Akash from Dudes and Tools and in this video I'll show you how to make a binary clock. What the is a binary clock? So if you already know how the clock works, skip a minute of the video before I bore you one of my lectures. Alright? So a binary clock shows the time in binary format, that is in zeros and ones. So I have got the conversion here for uh, decimal to binary and suppose the time was uh, 1745, that is 545 and uh, binary equivalent of this would be for 1 it's 1 for 7 it's 1 1 1 for 4 it's 100 and for 5 it's 101 so now if uh, this were a matrix, matrix of LEDs the 4 by 4 matrix of LEDs and the zeros were LEDs being off and ones were LEDs being on if the light glows in this pattern, the time would be 1745, that is 545. So another uh, easy way to decode this would be to consider uh, the first row as 2 power 0, 2 power 1, 2 power 2 and 2 power 3. So here 2 power 2 would be 4, 2 power 1 would be 2, 2 power 0 would be 1. So adding these up, it will be sum up to 7. That denotes this 7. So that's how you decode a binary clock. So to make this work, you will need three things. A microcontroller obviously. So I'm going to use a 80 mega 328. At 8 megahertz. I'm not going to use the external clock. I'm going to use the internal clock which the 80 mega 328 has and something to keep the time that is done by an RTC a real time clock you can actually use the 80 mega 328 to keep the time but once you power it off and on uh, the time will be reset and you will have to uh, again set the time to get it accurate so a real time clock keeps the time you gotta read the time from RTC uh, using the 80 mega 328 and display it using an 8 by 8 LED matrix. So this is the RTC module which keeps the time and this is the 80 mega 328 and this is an LED matrix it's got 8 by 8 uh, that is 64 LEDs so now we are going to prototype the, the binary clock using an Arduino so instead of this we we'll use an Arduino to prototype and program and then we'll uh, once the program is finalized we'll upload it to the 80 mega 328 and breadboard it up so program the 80 mega 328 I will skip the Arduino part uh, for the video uh, and the clock works fine first four rows show the time and the top four rows show the date so I will post the wiring and code somewhere for you guys to refer so like the next step would be to make this uh, get this on a more permanent setup So I've got the board laid out here, the microcontroller would be here, the RTC would uh, go into this pin and the matrix would go here. So I already connected the wires and uh, let's solder now. So I have soldered the required uh, connections and I have soldered an extra USB cable for powering the board.
so our binary clock is ready so I'm gonna power the board now that's my name good day you can customize your initial sequence and that's the binary clock if you have decoded the time correctly it is 21 24 I mean 26 Bang. so the clock works fine add some aesthetic bits and put it on your desk for people to see the time dude why do you want to make it so hard for people to look at the time that my son is the right question <laughs>